Hey there, this is Mike from Match Digital Media. Uh, we're in March 2019, and I've got another quick tip for you in regards to Adobe Premiere. Uh, in the case of the update to 2019, the most recent version, at least as of today, uh, you might have a problem with opening up previous projects into the newest version and then find that some of those files are all unlinked and offline. That's what happened to me in one of my projects I was working on and in this case I'm just doing a little test for you just to demonstrate what was going on and how you can fix it. Uh, but if you had for instance there was an there were a number of files that were offline but in this case this file is offline and if I go ahead and I try to relink the media and go in and try to find it okay well here it is and try to relink and what I get is this error message that says the importer reported a generic error and uh, so <laughs> what do you do in that particular case well it took a while to find out and in, in, in the case of Adobe what they recommend is to do the following um, so you would get out of this and what you need to do is go into they suggest going into the preferences into media cache look in the ta in the case of the media cache path here and what you need to do is find this on your computer, figure out where this is, um, and then go back from there. So in, in my case, I went ahead and I found it. It is this path here, this path that matches um, what it is in this, in this dialogue here. Okay, so what you need to do once you find that folder where the media cache uh, files are located you need to find two folder names and one is media cache and the other one is media cache files and they recommend what you do is just rename it and it's okay to do this with the application open just rename it to something here media cache files just rename it to something doesn't matter what it is what it's going to do is when Premiere restarts it's going to rebuild those folders and essentially discard this information it will no longer be connected to these old files uh, so when you go back into Premiere uh, in the preferences uh, they recommend that you go ahead and clean the uh, media cache files folder okay and then go ahead and restart Premiere. So we'll go ahead and restart Premiere and it's going to force it to create recreate those folders that we just changed. So now there's going to be a fresh version of those particular folders in that uh, library location. On. And in this case, of course, as you can see, I'm using a Macintosh. Not exactly sure the path situation of how it's going to work for a PC, but for, if you're on a Macintosh, this is what you need to do. So as you can see, it has recreated these folders again. Okay, so now we are back in the actual project, and if you go ahead and try to relink this file... now it relinked so that's what you have to do in order to get it to uh, to fix that issue um, anyway if you have any questions regarding this if you want to refer to the comments below that'd be awesome thanks and have a great day